Hello guys, and today apparently I've got a free tablet, apparently, which has been provided by an organisation called Shaw Trust for Unemployed People, and is in league in some way with the Job Centre, okay? And because I couldn't access one of their websites, because it's truthfully written by Paul in his damn unreliable, and had problem accessing Teams, which they want me to use, um, they've given me a free tablet. Now, I've not opened it yet. This is apparently a free tablet, okay, which I've been told I have to set up and use for a particular purpose that they've given me, but I can apparently keep it forever, okay? Now, I've no idea what kind of tablet it is. I've no idea what's in this box. This is exactly as it came um, by Curry Company that delivered it to me. So you are about to see whatever I'm about to see. I have no idea what's in it. I've not opened it. Right, so, I think it's going to be easy to open it from the bottom. So I've got a pair of scissors here. Right. No idea the brand or anything at all. No, my luck, it'll be something that's not even what I'm saying, it'll be the wrong thing. Anyway. Oh, wow, okay. <laughs> okay, so it works over Wi Fi. Just what I wanted. Now it says um, Tab M8 HD. I'm willing to bet that means it's probably just got 8 megabytes in it or something. Um, I mean, I can't really complain because I only need it for. I and mean, whatever they tell you. So it says 2G plus 32 gigabytes. Oh, so it's. Wi-Fi Iron Grey 2G plus 32 gigabyte 2G? I mean, wow, I'm amazed at that. I mean, how about a foot? They have at least 3G or 4G. Maybe they've... So, okay, as I said, I have not set this up, obviously. It looks like it's brand new. Um... It says 2 gigabytes RAM, 32 gigabytes storage, Android. Right. Mm. Okay. Obviously, it'll need charging, so it won't work straight away. See, for all you um, capitalists out there in America, etc., um, you know who you are if you're watching this. This is what you get with socialism, right? Free stuff, right? You can argue if it's good or bad, but there you go. That's what you get in a country that where the taxes are much higher. But when, you know, you're in tr you know, deep financial trouble or other things, uh, it's there to help you, okay, supposedly. So, never mind, I'm going to try and... Cut the tab. Right. And there's a tab at the bottom, so let's get rid of that one as well. Now maybe this is an oldie model and they're getting rid of them, I have no idea. Um, I'm not going to set up in front of you on camera, I'm just trying to show it you, okay? Because I know it will. So, I've got this as well. And this is the tablet itself. Um, I'm not in the modern world. Yeah, this looks like the tablet itself. 
and on the back it's got a camera so this is the actual tablet itself I've no idea how you charge this I'm assuming they've put yeah, I've also got a cavity here so I'm going to take out this cavity and here you've got the um, the charger so it's just a essentially a USB um, charging adapter so you know you can put you could put you could charge anything with this I believe virtually so I don't know what the ampage is or how fast a charger it is um, I've got my own charger anyway which does the same thing so got a wire here so yep so here it's got the socket to charge it so just basically I'm too late I'm just going to chop it with the scissors and I'm going to plug it in It's got the start guide here, so yep. I'm hoping this is the W Land version because I haven't got. any sim cards or anything like that so let's see where's the card tree All right. I'm going to do something quite brave. I'm going to try and see if I can charge it up via the computer. So, yep, when the little lights come on, like that, so, lights come on red. I don't know if that means it's not powerful. Oh, here we go. So, It's showing it's at 71%. I know nothing about Android. I've sat something on a computer which, um, you know, looks like Android. Um, you know, I forget the name now. Um, I'll put one on that looks similar to Android, you know, on a PC, and it's a special operating system that supposedly runs Android or something similar to Android. But I've forgotten off the top of my head what it was. Um, I'm going to see what happens if I switch this on. Um, Maybe this is it. Here we go. It's acting like a mirror at the moment, showing what's in the room, which isn't really what I want, because it's just showing the screen, which is not what I wanted it to do. Um, why has it stopped?
that's coming up with a Land Rover sign. I'm amazed that I can't easily film this, but. I uh, English. Right, it says, do I want access to... Yeah, I'll accept absolutely anything, because I haven't a clue. I'm searching for Wi-Fi networks. Um, I set my one. Okay. I'm going to put in a password, but I'm not going to show it you. Getting your tablet ready, this may take a few minutes. I'm afraid you, you probably can't see this because um, it's difficult to film it because it's shiny and you know, I don't think my computer's really designed for something like this. <laughs> like I said, it should be interesting because I know nothing about Android, not properly, you know. Um, Oh yeah, and you also get these little bags as well in it, so so that it wouldn't um, get damaged in transit. The actual packing company um, put these in, these sort of squeezy things. They're quite thick and you also get a delivery note. I got a delivery note as well from the courier company as well. And this is actually inside, by the way. So this is actually inside it. Not outside, inside. Okay. I'm going to tell you what they'd actually um, sent. So. Yep, and it's got copy apps and data. So, um, Google account and more. This should be interesting. Um, I'm going to check from my backup. I haven't got an Android phone. I mean, I haven't got one. Right, it says checking for updates. So I thought it would actually um, allow us to sync with YouTube or something, but. Checking info. Okay, sign with your Google account. Right, okay. Um. It's just I don't want you guys to see the password, even though it's... Um, skip it. It's asking if I want to add a password. I, you probably can't see it anyway, so I'm going to go skip. Um, 
I'll just go until I agree. Um. Alright, getting your account info. I don't know what the hell it's doing. It looks like it's switched itself off for some silly reason. What's going on? Did I press the wrong button? Okay. I feel like one of these people like in the 80s, you know, when they, they got their children to like set the video recorder, you know, because they didn't know how to use it and it's really embarrassing. Get your tablet ready. I hope I don't have to go for this rigmarole again. frustrating if this doesn't work either. <laughs> oh, oh no, it started all over again. Oh god. That is so bloody annoying. I've already typed all this rubbish in, so it's going through the whole rigmarole again. What good is it? Oh, it's all, it's all, it's ready, right? Oh, I can't add it, it's already done it, okay. Oh, it's just dating time now. Right, so dating time. Yeah, I'm... I'm just going to say London. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, so it's just the time and the place. No, you can't probably see it at all, but never mind. I'm worried about anything else later, really. I'll just accept anything. Oh no. I'm not bothered with screen and look at the moment. The last thing I need is some more bloody problems. Okay. 
I'm sure I can always do things like protection stuff in the future anyway, so. What a palaver, I mean, when I got the um, iPod Touch, I just, I didn't need to go through any of this rubbish. Okay. I'll just skip it. No thanks. It's just... Oh god. Just various screens now. I'll let them I'll, I'll let them be nosy and and show. Right now, is it gonna actually finish well wow. is it actually gonna come on now it's just made a noise right so I'm now in Android okay um I'm going to bring up YouTube a minute. Oh dear. It's good. It says it wants an update, so I'll update it. It says it takes less than a minute usually. I don't believe that. It might be true. Um, Oh, it might just be because it's an app rather than... going on why does it keep switching off all the time god that is annoying oh hang on it is annoying it keeps switching off all the time it's at 71% battery so I don't know why it keeps switching off Probably thinks it's doing you a favour, but <laughs> there must be a way where you know, like. And I prefer the um, iPod Touch method, and the same they've got an iPad, where you just press a button and. It suddenly brings up everything, but maybe 
There's another button. I don't know what that button does. I don't know what the buttons do at the moment. And um, Um, I think this is a bit more than a minute, but I could be wrong. It's probably because I've probably not got the fastest internet connection by today's standards, to be honest. Um, but Five minutes left. They said it would take a minute. I'm sure these people are absolutely cringing at this, thinking, just hit this, just hit this, but, um, you know, I've no idea what, I should get the instruction book out, which is embarrassing, um, add touch screen, proximity sensor, volume buttons, Where's the on button? I know it. Right, card tray. Seven. Power button. What's six? Volume button. So these have volume. So we've got the volume up and down then, apparently. Right. So. And we can't easily see it here, but. I can turn the volume up and down apparently, but how you actually get anything, I've no idea. And um, I don't like the fact it's not a home button, I just. I know they don't do that anymore apparently on tablets these days, but I just like the idea of you just press one button and you go straight to, you know, it's like help, and it just takes you straight there. So. Yeah, so it's now finally still downloading YouTube and it said it'd be a minute but it's been much longer than that as you can tell and then I'll try and see what's going on I don't like the fact it keeps switching off all the time, which is, you know, goddamned annoying. Right, new version. Maybe it's installing. A new um, 
version of the operating system, so... Is it going to restart? Is it going to come back on again, or would you have to do it yourself? No, it's doing it itself, okay. Right, and there you go, it's now got a line going along, I'll try and install it. I mean, this is an absolute rigmarole. I mean, when I got my iPod Touch, I just switched it on. I think I don't think I did much, and it started working immediately, so. I can't do anything while it does this, so never mind, but anyway, I'm, I know this is an incredibly boring video showing you the get setting up a, you know, a tablet. I'm sure a lot of people out there are going to have a good laugh at this, especially considering I am an old IT expert in the past, but, you know, I'm not in the modern world. I've never used Android, you know, so not the real one like this is, so... Hopefully it'll finish soon. I'm so for this guys and it's damn like boring but never mind. Um and before anybody else, I daren't take this into town and use it to film things. I'd rather not, even if it does a good job, because to be completely honest with you, um, as the government of or whoever it is on behalf of the government have paid for this for me. I don't want to damage it, you know. I can't really ask them to buy me another one if I damage it, can I? So, you know. And what again, while it's doing this, the box says it's a Tab MA MD. 
HD, I mean, sorry, um, MHD. I've got these other little icons on the back. I don't know what they all mean, but never mind. I probably could if I spent my time looking at it, but, you know. Oh, it's still, it's restarted and it's still updating. Mm -hmm. I don't like the fact you have to keep pressing this button all the time. I know they're trying to save battery, but this is ridiculous, you know. Oh, right, finally. I've got something. Finally. Okay, so I'm going to go into YouTube. Oh, Christ. I'm not interested in this rubbish. I just want to use the damn thing. Gesture. Update your app. I thought I've just done that. Update your app. going on all this was supposed to take what less than a minute according to them but in fairness they might think you've got like 5g or something well, not 5g but you know um, gigabit broadband or something and I don't you know So I've got the like cheapy broadband, not the like one hundred pound a month broadband, you know. I'm not interested in all this rubbish. Like a review, I just want to use the thing. <laughs> I'll be honest, at least with the iPod Touch, you could at least um, do other things while it's doing that, so okay. Beta program is full. The beta program for this app is currently full. What's the point? Mm. Finally, I can click on open. Now we're in YouTube. I better stop this because um it's not my video so um Thank <laughs> you. 
Right, and here's a video of me earlier, which I did on put on YouTube myself, of me discussing your vision. I've only done this because there won't be any copyright issues with it, and um, because I, you know. Hello, guys. By the way, I'm like this because it's very, very hot at the moment. Okay, over here. Well, by our standards. Okay, so. Um, there you go. That's me watching me. And um, from the past. Okay. Um, Time travel, guys. Weekend and um, also. And you you'll be today. watching me, anyway, watching me, so you'll have an even weirder, um, now, you know, like set of time travel, you know? Because, um, you know, but it is genuinely breaking news. You might think, well, it's not really breaking news. <laughs> okay, right. Now, that's it, so... Right, I might have to block them out, so I don't know. Um, right, so I'll, that's all I dare do at the moment, because otherwise it'll bring up some BBC stuff, I know. I'm going to turn the sound all the way down, so it won't be any copyright issues. Um... I wish I knew how you actually. Oh dear. I think I'll have to learn this, but anyway, um, it's not as intuitive, from what I can tell, as the iPad system, because I played with iPads and things, you know, in shops, and it's not as intuitive. But maybe it's just me, and um, I just need to find a way of. I mean, I just, it's like, you know, where, without a home button, where you just press it, it's like all the little icons for the main thing. It's just frustrating, truthfully. Um, help. <coughs> it takes to the beginning of YouTube, but I want to know how you take it to the beginning of the actual thing itself. I know everybody here is just absolutely going to be laughing their heads off, and I think that might be it, maybe. <laughs> you idiot, because I know lots of people have got Android phones, and they think, oh, it's obvious how you sort this out, but I just want to... Anyway, this is me looking an extreme idiot, and it's extremely embarrassing, and I'm really showing my age. Um, maybe there's some... Oh, got it. Right, so I can drag this somehow out. Somehow I've managed to get it, this main screen back. God knows how I did that, but somehow I did it, so... Um, apparently you've got to 
do something like this. Mm, I really don't like that at all. It's not as intuitive as an iPhone, I'm sorry. Well, I haven't got an iPhone, but I've got an iPod Touch, but it's the same interface, you know. I'm probably going to have to watch a video on how to use Android. But never mind. There's also some special things I've got to download from the internet for what they want me to do. Like Microsoft Teams and stuff. Um, but anyway. <laughs> that pretty issue. I... This is the, um, as I said, the Lenovo Tab M8, okay? I'm going to quit now because otherwise I'm sure you're going to be bored to death with me failing to use a tablet, which is really, really embarrassing as I'm really, really technical. But there you go. Really embarrassing, but as I said, I've never had an, had a, an Android thing before, so there you go. Not as intuitive as I would like. Um, I still think maybe iPhones are better, I don't know, but there you go. Anyway, um, thanks for watching guys, bye!